What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today we're back on the Let's Play Town Hall 10 account and we're going to be working on just general farming today and we need a lot of elixir. I separated the uh, progress base here so you can see we don't have a whole lot done. We have like our collectors, our mines, our drills, a few drills, our storages. And that's really about it. We got, you know, one barracks over here, one dark barracks over here. We got our spell factories, but we have a ton of work to do. And today what we're going to be doing is working on getting two more of these barracks down. We got two out of five builders available, and we'll be having another builder uh, sometime tomorrow uh, available. So I want to get two of these build these barracks down, and hopefully maybe even the third one uh, later tomorrow. So that's going to be the battle plan for today, guys. And in order to do that, we're going to be doing some goblin farming. Now I know I have go wipe train. I'll explain that here in a second. But we're just going to do some mass goblin farming. The easiest way just to hit some dead bases down here in Crystal League. So that's the battle plan for today. If you guys are pumped up for it, make sure you subscribe, turn on those notifications, and leave a like on the video. As always, guys, uh, why wouldn't you leave a like on the video? That lets me know that you guys are enjoying what I'm doing as a content creator and you guys are really pumped up for it. So tomorrow we will have uh, the Town Hall 7 push that rush account because I know you guys love that. But today we're on the Town Hall 10. So one thing I did while between the episodes is I put the Lava Hounds and the Clan Castle. This is our made last major offensive upgrade and then really we will have all the major pieces for War Armies uh, upgrading. So I spent the Dark Elixir to get our Lava Hounds level 3 going up of 70,000 Dark Elixir. So I am a little bit low on Dark Elixir. I'm also going to be farming uh, really soon to get the Queen up another level because I do have a Book of Heroes. So uh, that's what what's going on there. But I realized when I was getting ready to film this episode, uh, I didn't complete the triple threat event. I need one more army, one more completion for it. So that's what we're going to do first, and then we'll go ahead and hop in some goblin farming. So I'm going to go out, we'll find an army, or find a base to attack with this army to get our 90 free gems. All right, guys, this base has tons of loot, and we're going to go ahead and go in. Uh, so we need lots of elixir. So I'm going to go in on this side where the elixir is. I'd like to get some of the Dark Elixir if possible, but I really want to focus on Elixir in today's episode. That way we could try to get two of these barracks down. So we're going to go ahead, uh, get some wizards in, working on these guys. Uh, we'll wall breaker right there. Good thing I tested the one. One wall breaker right there. What do I have in my clan castle? We have another golem in the clan castle, so that's fun. I'm just going to throw like everything in here pretty much. And then we're just going to go for... Oh my goodness, there's a golem in the clan castle. We'll poison that queen just to slow her down just a little bit. And then we will rock and roll right on through this. I do need some wizards over here, though. All right, so that's looking really good. I'm going to go ahead and poison those skellies just to slow that down just a little bit here. But we're looking pretty solid through the core of this base. All we have to do is win this raid. Nothing fancy or anything like that. Uh, so we're going to keep, keep everything raged up and uh, keep them all working through this base here. So that'll be very beautiful. Oh, yeah, that's, that's exactly what we need. I didn't even put my queen in. Oh. That's always good when you can get all this without even putting your queen in. Always positive times. Uh, let's see. We'll go ahead and hit the king's ability there. Rage up again because why not? We'll try to get to that last little bit of dark elixir over here. Not necessarily the last little bit, but that little bit of dark elixir over here. Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead put the queen somewhere. I don't know where. Yeah, we'll just put her in and see where she goes. All right, she's going to go wandering around just a little bit. Those P.E.K.K.A.s and King are going to work out really well down there in the bottom of the base. Uh, and that's really all I did with this event was just dig right into the core of bases and grab tons and tons of loot really fast. Uh, we still do have a few P.E.K.K.A.s down here, so I'm going to let them keep working because no need to waste those P.E.K.K.A.s because they will get to that Dark Elixir right there in that drill. We got that Golem still going right there. We got our Queen. We got everything really spread around this base, so... What we're going to do is, on this base, I'm going to get the barracks all taken care of, and then we'll start talking about like what to upgrade as far as defenses and stuff. I always like to do traps, teslas, and air defenses first, so that's always going to be my number one priority. And then we'll start working on some of just like the regular defenses, you know, archer towers, cannons, wizard towers, etc., etc. I'm also going to go ahead and get my infernos up to level 3. I'm not going to worry about that, so whenever I have extra builders and the gold for it, I will go ahead and just get the infernos going up to level 3, but I really want to focus on getting those barracks going for sure, so... Queen's going to work out and get some more elixir and get a little bit of dark elixir here. We still got this herd of P.E.K.K.A.s down here. But really, I don't want to win. Like, I don't want to three-star the raid because I'm actually trying to drop down a little bit of trophies because that way we can find some easier bases for the goblins. But man, those P.E.K.K.A.s are so strong. We're going to let them take that out and then we'll go ahead and end right there. And there we go. We got all the loot. Almost 500,000 uh, gold. 
563,000 elixir and 5k dark elixir pretty solid raid so what i'm going to do is i'm going to come back here and if you guys have ever seen we got the 90 gems and 450 experience if you guys have ever seen me do goblin raiding all i do is just get a bunch of goblins a few wall breakers and just kind of keep them going honestly i don't do anything too crazy with it and then for spells i just you know do something like this so we're gonna go ahead and boost up for the next hour i'm probably not gonna do the full hour worth of boosting but we are gonna hit some solid raids in here so i'll be back once our goblin army is ready and we'll go hit some bases guys all right guys same thing here tons of loot on the outside of this base and that's what we're gonna do hit these dead mines and collectors with our goblins and just go forward with our day easy money here uh look at those walls up there nice little like level four walls maybe i don't even know those are those are low level walls let's see if we can get in right here let's see we'll go three wall breakers right there get that little bit of dark elixir and let's see we could try to knife in i don't really want to mm. it's a little bit tricky i really don't want to go for the town hall because i'm really trying to drop trophies but I feel like we might have to. All right, let's, uh... I really want this last little bit of Dark Elixir right here is my main thing. Actually, let's just go ahead and we'll jump right here. We'll end up getting this gold. We'll use a heal spell there. Rage spell there, because we don't have a ton of goblins left. Might not even have enough to get through. We don't. Too many defenses. Eh, it happens. But we still got tons of elixir, tons of gold, and a little bit of dark elixir. Wait for these goblins to train up, and we're going to go right back at it, guys. All right, guys, another tons of loot. Dead base here. Uh, and you can just see these collectors of mine just absolutely full to the brim out here. So that's what we're going to do. Get in there. Get those taken care of. Wall breaker in right there while those goblins are working. And we're just going to get as much of this loot as possible, guys. In and out. Again, we don't mind if we lose these raids. We do have our giants in the clan castle, so that'll help us tank to get into that last little area. But pretty simple stuff there, guys. We could actually use our heroes. I didn't even realize we have our heroes up also. So we can just go ahead and just get in here, get all this loot, and just move on with our day. Let's go ahead and send a few more goblins over there. Kings over there. That's looking good. We've got the giants in. Throw in a few more goblins. I'm not going to worry about that gold mine right there. We're just going to go forward with our day from there. Easy money, guys. We get 400,000, 400,000, 2,800 Dark Elixir. Can't complain about that. We're at 7.4 million Elixir on our way to 8 million. I was thinking about we might even do a Dark Barracks today. We'll kind of see how things go. So let's go ahead and keep hitting some raids, guys. All right, guys. Another big raid right here that we're just going to go ahead and get our goblins in here. And try to get as much loot as possible. Now, I did notice I'm one star away from a star bonus. So I might actually try to take out a town hall on one of these bases eventually. I don't know if this is a pretty good candidate for it here, but let's go ahead and go in. I forgot that we have one barracks down, so these armies are actually taking quite a bit to train up. I forgot all about, you know, if you have a barracks down. It takes a little bit longer to train. Alright, wall breakers finally get in there. Let's get that dark barracks. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and just jump right here. Uh, get the giants in there just to tank. Alright, that'll be good. And then we'll go ahead and get our gobbies in like so. Should work out pretty well for us, hopefully. Maybe. Uh, okay. We'll go ahead and put our king and queen over here. And then... Try to gain some of this elixir. For sure. I don't want to lose... I want to try to get as much elixir as possible in all these raids. But also, the goblins gotta cooperate! Come on, goblins! Alright, uh, so we're gonna end up missing that elixir collector right there. No, that's not a big deal. Goblins get wrecked up there. Let's go ahead and hop out of here. Eh, mediocre raid. Almost 400,000 of each and 4k dark elixir just about. So, pretty positive there. We're still dropping down trophies. We're at 7,800... Or 7.8 million elixir so we're doing pretty good there also on the gold we're gonna just use the gold to upgrade a few of these walls we have a few level 10 or level 9 walls that need to go to level 10 uh so we're gonna work on using that gold to do such and we'll be back all right guys another quick dead base and we're just gonna go in with our gobbies and then just get a bunch of easy loot oh man i love these raids so much they're so easy to get and the nice thing is since uh, we have a barracks down. Our goblins are taking long enough that we are getting giants in the clan castle almost every time, which is lovely. Let's get some wall breakers hopping in there. 
they kind of miss, but that's all right. Uh, Giants tanking those defenses up top. Let's uh, clear out these a little bit up here. Clear out that clan castle because why not? I want to get that drill and that drill right there. It seems like that's all we really have left is those two drills. Uh, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and put the king in here to tank. Didn't really work out too well. Hit the queen's ability. Queen, don't die on me. Queen, just get that last little bit. Go, queen, go, go. Okay, queen perfect there. Uh, let's see if we can get these gobbies in here. Go, goblins, go! I'm gonna heal him. I want that dark elixir bad! Go, goblins, go! King, get that loot! Okay, perfect. That works out, right? <laughs> and that's all we're doing, guys. Simple stuff. 400k, 400k, and 4k dark elixir. And we get to 8 million elixir, which is beautiful. Now, I was looking, and I was like, hmm, we could get our all the dark barracks. That way our bowlers aren't taking so long. That's six million, then we'd have to get a whole crap ton more. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and stick to doing the two barracks today. So we're gonna go ahead, we'll drop one barracks to unlock the miners. And then uh, we're gonna hit a couple more raids, probably another one or two more raids, and then we'll drop that last barracks uh, towards the end of the episode. All right guys, this is gonna be our final raid. I forgot how slow it is with two barracks down, let alone we're gonna have three barracks down. So after this raid, we'll go ahead and drop that last barracks Luckily, in war, I'm usually using a lot of dark troops, so it shouldn't really affect my train time on that, right? But man, having three barracks down is going to be a pain in the butt. We'll get past it. It'll be all right. Uh, we'll go ahead and get in here, try to get some of this dark elixir, hopefully. Oh my goodness, I can't get the dark elixir! Uh, we'll put our giants in there. Let them tank for the gobbies. Go, gobbies, go! All right, gobbies in. Mmm... I'm gonna put the king over here, queen right here. And we'll just let that kind of work itself out there. Not too bad, not too bad. So rather than worry about getting the dark barracks down, which would affect more things, I think I'm just gonna wait, uh, get all the regular barracks down. I'm gonna do three, I'm gonna have one up, and then when that next one comes up, I'm gonna work on getting the fourth one down. And that's kind of how we're gonna do things here. So a pretty decent little session today. We got tons of loot for sure. And we accomplished exactly what we wanted to. Get a little bit of Dark Elixir. We gotta, you know, get some Dark Elixir farming going to get that queen up. But, mostly, we get three barracks down going for miners. And miners are gonna be really huge because miners use pretty much no Dark Elixir to farm with. So we'll be able to grind the heroes pretty well with them. And we'll talk about that as our miners get unlocked. Probably after we get our fourth barracks unlocked. Uh, so once this one comes up in two days, I'll go ahead and drop that fourth one and we'll keep farming. I got miners, or goblins training, but you could see that it's going to take like an hour to train up those goblins. It's ridiculous. I'm just going to have a bunch of goblins on train and then, uh, you know, tune in every once in a while and just hit a goblin raid or two or something like that. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed today's episode. Like I said, we'll have the Town Hall 7 for you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. You guys have a great day. Keep on Clash Bashing.